So you've got this baby, you've got the album, which is another baby, and then I go into the studio today and there are paparazzi all outside of our studio. <laughs> all outside of our studio. I'm like, okay, I know it's a big day when they're all lined up. And they're all out there because there's news now that after, first of all, let's go back to what happened at your okay. home. Because we know that there's a police report that is out. What do you want your fans to know? Yeah, I, I just wish that um, my husband and I are, have started therapy recently. Um, and I, I wish that we had started it six months ago. You know, I wish we had gotten help and talked to someone sooner. I think it's made such a huge difference in such a short amount of time. And so like, if there's anyone out there who's watching, like this is your sign. If you've been thinking about it, go talk to somebody. It's helped us immensely. Um, the night, uh, what, what went down was so, Unfortunate. It was like the worst night of my life. And then, um, you know, to have to like have that out into in the world as I'm like getting ready to put out a record has been a lot. But all I can do is be honest about what I'm going through and what's going on. And, you know, I'm not the first person to have gone through this. So there was a tweet that's been since deleted. Yes. With an accusation from you to him about infidelity. Yes. And soon after, a tabloid um, obtained a police report. Um, in it, it indicated that there was an altercation potentially at the home and that there were allegations that you had slapped him. <laughs> so you don't deny it. They're not allegations. Oh, they're not. Okay. <laughs> well, we said violence, real raw. Vi violence, I, I don't condone violence. I slapped my husband, um, not the finest yeah. moment yeah. of my life. And full <laughs> disclosure, everyone knows that I <clears throat> speak out against violence, domestic violence, and, and, and I, one of the things I've not said publicly, even though I've done a lot of work inspired by the loss of my sister, I've been an advocate for people to understand that people make mistakes. And even in the world and conversation of domestic violence, we have to allow for people who make that mistake to be rehabilitated and have an opportunity to get it right. Yeah. We don't always show up on our best days. And I'll, and I'll tell you something else, Michelle. People said to me, well, if she were a male singer, yeah. would you be so kind to her? And I would, because everyone deserves their opportunity to say their piece. You've gone to therapy. Yeah. What are you dealing with or what are you learning in that therapy? And I know it's still very soon. Yeah, I mean, here I am. I, I'm only seven months postpartum from having a baby. I'm, I mean, every parent in the audience knows this, you know, sleep, stress, life stress, marriage stress, work stress. Um, definitely didn't. And also we had been out at a birthday party that night. I'd had a few drinks. It's like the, all the, the blocks were stacked in a way that, you know, I didn't have time to think about really yeah. what I was doing. Um, and, and it was like one of those things that I was like, is this really happening? Yeah. <laughs> Did this really just happen? Like, and you're realizing in real time, like, oh, I probably shouldn't have tweeted that. Oh, I probably definitely shouldn't have, you know, let my anger get yeah. the best of me. And um, yeah, it's unfortunate that it took this horrible traumatic event to hopefully um my husband and I are like maybe this like what how we were going was unsustainable so maybe this will give us the tools to have a stronger marriage than we've yeah. ever had so you know we're, sh we're rolling up our sleeves and doing the work which <laughs> never yeah. never sounds like fun but we're doing it